Uh, Ruth Cadbury. Thank you, Madam Deputy Speaker. Mm. Despite short-term tax cuts yesterday, families across the country know that they are worse off than they have been for 14 years. Uh, sorry, that, they that they're worse off than they were 14 years ago. Um, so why won't the Leader of the House urge the Prime Minister to call an election and let the British people give their views on this government? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, what the Honourable Lady says, I'm afraid, is not the case. Uh, we have got an enormous number of people into work, and the best way for people to lift themselves out of poverty is through work. Two million of that four million are uh, women. Uh, a million of them are disabled people who would have not had the dignity of a pay packet uh, unless we had brought through welfare reforms that made uh, work pay and supported people in work. We have an enormous childcare package which, uh, uh, under the previous Labour administration, uh, they went nowhere near. Uh, and we know that those pe people living in absolute poverty uh, has reduced uh, pensioners by 200,000. Uh, children by 400,000. Uh, on any measure, the country is doing better. Uh, it has more opportunities in the future because of the things that we have do been doing in education. Uh, we are soaring up the international literacy tables. Uh, we have reformed post-16 education to enable people to get degrees without getting into massive amounts of debt, which is what happened under the Honourable Lady's party. What she says is not true, uh, and that's why we need to stay the course uh, and stick with this government.